Okay, in this problem, it says that uh, we're looking at uh, four bags of oranges, and the weights of the oranges are 10.2, 10.5, 10.3, and 10.3 pounds. And it says it wants us to create a 95% confidence interval for the mean weight. So the 95% confidence interval is going to put, uh, we put x bar in the middle, and we go plus or minus, and because we're dealing with means, we're going to use the t distribution, a critical t, times the standard error. Okay, and that's, uh, that's as simple as that. Now, the calculation of the standard error is going to be a little bit involved because we've got to find the standard deviation um, first, okay? But we can do this. So first we've got to find x bar. So x bar is going to be adding up the four numbers, 10.2 plus 10.5, 10.3, 10 10.3, divide by 4, and so my x bar is 10.325. And, uh, and so now to find, so that's going to go right here, 10.325, and then I still have plus or minus t times my standard error. So to find the... Um, the mean, I've got to subtract 10.325 from each of these, and I'm going to square all of these numbers here. Okay, and so the resulting numbers, negative 0.125, and negative 0 0.025. Okay, and i got to square each of these. Plus 0.175 squared, plus 0.025 squared, plus 0.025 squared. And so the sum of all of the squares, after I square them, gives me 0 0.0475. And then I divide by n minus 1, which is 3. And I take the square root of that answer. And so my standard deviation is 0.1258. My standard error, this part, is equal to s over the square root of n. So in this case, I have 0.1258 divided by the square root of n. I have 1, 2, 3, 4 measurements that I took. So it's going to be 0.1258 divided by the square root of 4, or divided by 2. And so my standard error is 0 0.0629. Okay, so times my standard error of 0 0.0629. And so now all I have to do now is find my critical t. The critical t I'm going to do by uh, going to the t distribution, and I'm looking up under 95% confidence, I'm looking for 3 degrees of freedom. So when I have 3 degrees of freedom, because it's n minus 1, Three degrees of freedom, the critical value that I see for 95% confidence is 3.128, or 182. 3.182, and so I have my confidence interval is 10.325 plus or minus this number times this number, 3.182 times 0 0.0629. So that's going to be plus or minus basically 0 0.200. Okay? So on the low end, I do 10.325 minus 0 0.200, and I get 10.125. And the on the high end, I do 10.325 plus 0 0.200, which gives me 10.525. So my 95% confidence interval is from 10.125 to 10.525. And the statement I would say is I am 95% confident that the population mean is between 10.125 and 10.525 pounds. 
okay